Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, you will watch some density demonstrations. Have you ever wondered why a hot air balloon rises into the air? Or what causes a hurricane? Or how can this huge ship float on top of water and not sink even though it has metal and steel? Some of this is related to density. Density is equal to mass divided by volume. In the following demonstrations, you will see how an object of less density will always try to settle on top of an object with greater density. So let's get started. Let's have a density demonstration using liquids. This is warm liquid, which is less dense than cold liquid. We're going to put it in some water that's at room temperature, and let's see what happens. In theory, this should stay on the bottom and this should rise to the top, but as you know in science, it may happen, it may not. So let's place this in here, try not to get my shirt wet. Okay, and let's see where that goes. And here is the warm liquid. Okay, and let's see here, the warm water obviously is going upward and the cold water is beginning to fall downward okay okay now you can really see the warm water the less dense water is going to the top and the more dense water is settling down to the bottom okay so again a density density demonstration we will show how less dense objects always settle on top of more dense objects. And we have them lined up in uh, less dense to more dense. This is 0.79 grams per milliliter. This is 0.93 grams per milliliter. Water is 1.0. And then the syrup is 1.37 grams per milliliter. So as I pour them in, they should settle on top. And I'll start at most dense and move to less dense. Okay, let's start with the most dense object, the um, syrup. So I'll go down the side. So here is the syrup. Next, the water should sit on top of that. I'll pour it carefully down. So then we have the water. You can barely see the separation there. Then we'll do some syrup. Excuse me, not syrup, oil. Pour the oil down the side. And finally, so far so good, finally the rubbing alcohol should sit right on top. And there we go. So we have corn syrup, water and oil then alcohol on top. Okay, now that it's settled out, you can see the most dense corn syrup on the bottom, the water, the oil, and then the less dense rubbing alcohol on top. Again, the concept, a less dense object will settle on top of a more dense object given the opportunity. I have two objects that are less dense than the beans. So this is a little bit more dense than the ping pong ball. And if you'll notice, as I shake it, the ping pong ball will come up before the heavier or more dense um, kind of tennis ball looking object. So let me shake. Okay, again demonstrating how a less dense object will settle on top of a more dense object. 